This is a how-to guide on how to light the thurible correctly and safely. You'll notice we're doing it on this table, and this is of utmost importance to do it on a flame-proof surface. We're using this table as it's got an insert made of stone. First thing to do is to open your thurible and place the charcoal dish in it. We've pre-covered it in foil as it makes it much easier to clean. Okay, so that goes in there. Then what you'll do is take one of these charcoal discs. They've got a groove on where the incense will sit. You use a pair of tongs or something similar. I'm using these scissors as it doesn't conduct heat. And then you hold it over a lit candle for about a minute until it gets red hot. And it will smoke a little bit, but don't worry. It'll smoke initially and then it will just remain hot. So once that's heated up, you push it into the dish in the center so it's nice and level. And then you take a special incense boat where the incense is kept. Take a small spoonful and being careful, very careful not to touch the thurible or the incense dish at this point because it gets very hot. You put a small amount into the little groove in the charcoal and that will immediately begin to smoke and smell really nice. And then carefully without touching any of the, the foil or the charcoal Place the lid back on and then once again carefully to avoid spilling, although it is quite sturdy. It's very long chains. And there you go, the smoke will be coming out of all the holes and gaps in the thurible and then you're ready to give it a swing.